everybody, welcome back to my channel. Look. No, oh, that one's heavy. <laughs> Got friend mail. So it's birthday month. If history tells me anything, we'll have a lot of birthday mail in the month of July. And June for that matter. So I wish I could share this to you without revealing my address. <laughs> but my address is on here a couple of times. This is from Ann Batts. Ann has sent me so much... I mean, really so much beautiful, I think that's who it's from, yeah. Um, so much beautiful stuff in the past, uh, you know, the Harry Potter printables The I'm gonna use for my birthday, and she gave me the Niffler, um, or Niffler. I should name a man. Because Niffler is a breed, I shouldn't just call him by his breed, should I? It's like, hey, all you humans out there. Um, okay. I'm trying to open it in such a way as to keep her beautiful artwork, but she basically drew an owl because again, if you're not familiar with the Harry Potter world, I'm um, sorry about that. No, um, if you're not familiar with the Harry Potter world, everything is mailed via owl. And she actually put a fake label on here that says owl post. I wonder if I can show you that without showing you everything else. I can do that. You know what? Maybe I'll try to remember to take a photo of it and then I can share it. Because I could cover my address, but then my address is on the printed label up there. So it's like even if I cover my address, I won't be able to cover my address if that makes sense. <gasps> no. Uh uh. This isn't a geek gear box. I know you're lying. Maybe it's just the box. <laughs> so Geek Gear is, has uh, I think Geek Gear has actually a lot, but Geek Gear is where you can get some Harry Potter merchandise. It's like a subscription box that you can get. And this says limited edition wizardry, handmade with love, but I love the box and no matter what's inside. <gasps> oh, it's Mad Eye Moody. Mm. Okay. Okay, first things first. Oh my Lord. There is this envelope that came open. It looked like she had tried to close it with some Harry Potter tape. But what it has is it, it has Gringotts coins, which is money from the Harry Potter world. Oh my goodness, so many things. <gasps> I totally need this. This is just in time, Anne. Oh my God, I'm gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. Hold it together, shh. <laughs> so this is the seal um the letters are that you get from hogwarts that tells you you're accepted to the school have a wax seal uh, described as a purple wax seal and it's stamped with this hogwarts crest um Thank you so much. I tried to find one and it was very difficult. Um, oh my goodness, look at all of the stickers. First of all, I'm just loving the envelope. I will tell you that, let me let me say that first. I mean, it's just a, it looks like a waxy type of envelope. Um, Anne has a, a paper business. I. I'm gonna ask her, because I think one time I shared it with her, one time she said don't share it. So, look in the comments down below for a pinned comment. Um, if Ann shares it, then I'll pin it. If not, I will just share it and then pin it, if it's okay with me. But she sent me two packages of the Gringotts coins. And then this is absolutely beautiful. This is a Slytherin necklace encased in like an enamel. That is so cool. That is so cool. You know, that could double as a locket. I won't tell anybody. But these are amazing. They're like vinyl stickers. That one says Harry Potter. 
That one says, make love, not horcruxes. That's fantastic. Lisa's going to want to steal that from me because she's a hippie, a hippie potterhead. This, this, this is the Death Eater symbol. Um, oh, this is Harry Potter in his dress robes for uh, the dance, the Wiz Triwizard Bowl. Yule Bowl they had during the Triwizard Tournament. Never mind. That's Harry Potter's lightning scar and his glasses. <gasps> Oh, I love this one. This one says, did I drop it? This one says always. And without spoiling anything, because I actually said um, not to spoil anything. And then I shared something. And then somebody in the comments was like, you spoiled it for me. Sorry. So um, this says always. And this is the Deathly Hollow symbol. That's not a secret. <laughs> um, oh, that's so cool. It's like a golden snitch. I love the fact that they're black and white too, by the way. This is a, a feather, but it's, I was gonna say it's not a quill. Um, one of the first spells that they learn, well, actually the first spell that they learn for levitation, um, they use a feather for practice. Wingardium Leviosa. It's Leviosa, not Leviosa. Okay. This is the mirror of Erised, and it's the mirror of Erised. I'm not spoiling it for anybody. But if you read the description, the, the inscription on the top of the mirror of Erised, it reads back what says, I show you not what, I show you not your reflection, but what your heart desires. Or desire. Wait, okay, hold on. Let me read it, because it's, I'm going to paraphrase, and I shouldn't paraphrase, I should just get my magnifying glass and read it, because it's really little. Let's see. Uh, it's, it says, Erised... Sira Eru Oit Yub Kafru Oit on Waus. So a Wowsy. So it actually says, I show you not your reflection. No, your face, but your Heart's Desire. So without giving anything away from the first movie. I think you can guess now what the mirror does. Oh my God, these are amazing. And then there's like two of each. She sent me two of everything from... Oh, and thank you so much. Did I drop something? No, I didn't. I just thought I did. Oh my gosh, I'm not crying. Um... I guess it's batting. <laughs> oh, she's gonna have to tell me. She's using, this is like shredded, um, this is like shredded fabric. What they do is they recycle old materials. They take scraps from factories. I just don't know where she got it, but it's pretty amazing. Um, that's pretty amazing. Oh, that's really cute. This is a statue of Luna, love good dressed in her Gryffindor. Um, she's not in Gryffindor, but she dressed up as the Gryffindor lion to support Harry. Well, I guess it was to support Harry. Maybe she's just a fan. I haven't gotten to that part and they didn't mention why in the movie. Um, of uh, For Quidditch, I'm sorry. So that's really cute, Anne, thank you. Oh my goodness. This is Mad-Eye Moody. This is Professor Moody. He is the Defense Against the Dark Arts teacher at one point. I'm just saying that. That's all I'm gonna say. And they show you in the back some other pop vinyls that you can get. If you've never heard of this, is like a pop vinyl. This is Pop is the name of the brand. These are like vinyl. They're not, I don't know if they're bobbleheads, but I don't know if they're considered bobbleheads. They're just like their own thing. But they do technically bobble their head, so. It's by Funko. Oh my goodness. Hold on. Oh my. What in heaven's name? This is beautiful. Oh, this is from Geek Gear. 
There is this beautiful print of Ron. This is Harry, this is Ron. And they're at, it looks like, it, like divination class because they're staring into a crystal wall. And they're dreaming about Hogwarts in the wintertime. That's amazing. It is there in front of the Christmas tree. So maybe that's what they're thinking about being at Hogwarts at Christmas time or being home for Christmas, perhaps. I'm not sure. That is amazing. I know for most of you, you just like, you can just let the emotions go, but sometimes I really like lose it and I, it's hard. Oh my goodness. At the second one stroke, Yule beverage will be served. At the first one stroke, lead your partner to the dance floor. At the third one stroke, Yule feast will be served. This is the poster for the Yule ball. At the fourth one stroke, witch and wizards of, of the ball will be announced. At the uh, fifth one stroke, Yule parade of wand skills. And at the sixth one stroke, Final Yule dance, then good night to all our very special guests. Strictly dressed to impress, see Professor McGonagall for details. That is amazing. Oh, I have got to get a poster frame. I have got to get a poster frame. It looks 11 by 14, but I'm definitely gonna measure it because I do not wanna have to cut it. I'm not cutting it is what I mean to say. Oh my gosh. I'm trying so hard not to cry and it's like, <gasps> this is gorgeous. Serious Black, if you don't recognize Gary Oldman. This is when he was in Azkaban prison, it looks like. That is a beautiful rendition. I mean, as a, as a Harry Potter fan, as a lover of Serious Black, as an artist, this has hit me in all the feels. That is amazing. Man, thank you so much for thinking of me. I can't believe this. And there's something else in the bottom, which, oh gosh. Oh, no way. This is a the Hogwarts Crest poster. That's the four houses. The lion represents Gryffindor. The snake is Slytherin. The badger is Hufflepuff. And the crow is, well, the raven. It's not a crow. Is Ravenclaw. Um, and it says Hogwarts. And that's beautiful. It's like a watercolor. You guys are really having trouble. There we go. Without the light. There we go. Look how pretty that is. Oh my gosh. And then here's another poster, official contestant of the Triwizard Tournament for Bo Battens. Bo Battens is the, fre the French wizard school. That doesn't mean anything to you, I'm sorry. Um, but they are, I think, I don't think they're all girls. They might be all girls. I heard different things. I'm not deep into the lore like that um, because I don't read as well. Uh, you know, reading puts me to sleep. If you might not know that at all. So I'm currently listening to all the books. Um, and then, oh my goodness. Look at those eyes. It's, uh, it's just speaking to me like, um, this is the Demi guys. From Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. It is like as soulful of a creature as it's represented in its eyes here. <laughs> Do you see that? That is beautiful. 
it just looks like a print of a charcoal drawing. It could be, it could be just gray shades of watercolor, but it looks like charcoal or even graphite, to be honest with you. It could be both mixed media. My gosh, it's so beautiful. And now that I'm done, And thank you so much. That, first of all, I was excited just to get the box. Like you could have put peanut butter and jelly sandwiches in there and it would have just made my day. Um, oh my goodness, but this is, oh, you're so sweet. <laughs> thank you so much. You're, it's over the top. It really is. Thank you. Let me put this away and figure out how I'm going to figure this box, okay. Sorry, it's a big box. So normally, I'm not normally, but I've gotten big boxes before. But this one is extremely heavy. Like, I'm trying to figure out how this person sent me books. <laughs> That's what it feels like. Um, this is from Robin in Maryland. Hi, Robin. Thank you. Um, I'm going to turn a little bit just so I can open it without hurting myself. Um, gosh. I did it, I did it. Oh. Crazy to think something so easy as opening a box, take it all out of you, right? Man, if I was young, oh my. Oh my goodness, it's just full of stuff. It's just full of stuff. Let's start at the top. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, that is so pretty. That is a hook that says family. It says it was $2.50 from Interiors by Design. That is so pretty. Thank you, Robin. Um, distributed by Midwood Brands. So I don't know, I never heard of that before, but that's so pretty, thank you. Okay, in the back, Spa Life, Hydrolauric Acid, Anti-Aging Hydrating, Youth Activ Three-Step Youth Activating Treatment. And I got two of them. Thank you, Robin. Uh, let's see. Ooh, these are pretty. I didn't see these at my store. That is so pretty. These are two bandanas and they're really nice. So they have sort of like a vintage uh, farmhouse sort of feel and they're from the Dollar Tree. Oh my, those are pretty. Thank, <laughs> Thank you, Robin. <laughs> uh, she got me a magnifying light magnifying a light a lighted magnifier i have one here and this is going to be great to put in my purse so i don't have to struggle anymore <laughs> you can tell like the struggle is real what is this strawberry cheesecake flavored wafers what 73 percent cream what those look amaze balls wow those look really good. Oh wow, those look really good. Is that my treat? It's just a box full of stuff. Oh, it's a beautiful bookmark and it says, with Jesus you can. Oh, that's so pretty. Do you see that? It's wood and it's like etched or yeah, it's etched. You can feel it. And it's got this beautiful bead detail on the end. Thank you, Robin, that's so sweet. Oh, the Farm Fresh Pig Notebook. <laughs> so if you've not seen this notepad from the, there you go, from Dollar Tree. This one has the pig on it. It says Farm Fresh. A lot of people do a lot of DIYs with this. So thank you, Robin. That's going to be nice. Ooh, a red dish towel. Because my kitchen, right? Oh, she found the dish pot rags. What am I saying? Dish cloths. I call them dish rags, but I realized that that wasn't right. And then we call dish rags or somebody who gossips a lot in my family. So I wanted to make sure I got it right. But she found the red truck dish cloths. Yay! And pot holders. So cute, Robin. Thank you. There is something wrapped up in this bag. This bag is from the Dollar Tree. It says, here, here is a hedgehog. There's a hedgehog right there. But I love those linen bags. You know that, right? Okay. Ah, ah. Oh, 
We lost some stuff. Hold on. Let me get it. Okay. Oh, this must be... I'm going to close it. Nobody saw it. Shh, this is the white bag. So I mentioned it in the last video. But this is the white bag. It's from Robin. So I did apologize to... <laughs> Mary, Mary's like, I was very confused. And I was like, Mary, it was my confusion. I mixed up the emails with the names. So this is for Jim. So I'm gonna leave it over here for Jim. I will record him opening it later. Ooh, chocolate chip cookie skillet. But what, this is on a cast iron skillet. I saw these at Christmas time and I was like, yes, please. Just for the skillet alone, but that's awesome. Thank you, Robin. I'm gonna add it to my mini skillet collection. Oh my God, so much stuff. This is unicorn poop lip balm. <laughs> ah, it looks, looks like a, a rainbow unicorn poop. And this is salt range Himalayan pink sea salt nasal inhaler. Ooh, we'll try that. I ain't mad at that. It's natural mint, cool, cooling and refreshing. So sometimes when I'm so congested before I actually take my nasal medication, I use an inhaler to open the, the mucus up so I can get the medicine in there. So that's gonna be awesome, thank you. Ah. <laughs> Some sanitizer, cause you know, COVID. Hmm. Oh my, what's this? So that's a eyeglass holder, like a sunglass holder. And in it is three, Oh my goodness, how cool. Those are three knives. These are from the Dollar Tree. I did not see these. These are by Cooking Concepts and they each have a sleeve that is zip tied on there. That is so cool. Thank you, Robin. I never saw these before. Oh my goodness, and it looks like pink, blue, and gray. Those are awesome. Or green. I do that to you all the time, don't I? It's green, isn't it? Like, cause that's great, yeah, okay. Those are so cool. Those are really cool. Jim's gonna be stoked about that. Should've put that in his bag. <laughs> Munchy mix, sweet, salty snacks. Uh, chocolate dipped, chocolate double dipped pretzels, yogurt covered, I mean, cho chocolate double dipped peanuts, yogurt covered pretzels, Salted pretzels, raisins, dry roasted nuts, and salted peanuts, chocolate chip cookie buttons, and premium white chips. Boy, does that sound amazing. Holy cow. That sounds amazing. Oh, she got me the canvas that says forever blessed with every breath. Amen, sister. Thank you so much. That is beautiful. She got my number. This is Body Ecology Coconut Hibiscus. Shower jelly, what? Body Ecology, why does that sound familiar? Is that from Walmart? Let's just see if it's got a seal so I can make sure, yeah. I was gonna say, is it gonna spill all over me? Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Oh my goodness, what did it say it was? Coconut Hibiscus. That's beautiful, thank you. So it looks like that, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I didn't show you. All right, I can stop shopping now. She sent me the DIY marquee letter in H. Thank you. That's so silly. I really held it in the whole time. This is truly a huge box of love, Robin. Thank you. What do we have here? Foldable fans. So we've got some Americana fans. Those are really cute. You're gonna need them on 4th of July because you'll be like, woo! We got this cute pie with a rolling pin that says happiness is homemade. I love that. And the box is, I think is navy blue and the background is like a green 
uh, paneling board, like a shiplap type of whitewashed. Oh, oh these are cute, low cut socks for women. Oh, those are so pretty. There's like this really cute rainbow stripe and these really cute, cute little rainbow dots with iridescent in them. Oh, thank you, Robin. Those are adorable. The felt letters from Crafter Square, that you get a hundred pieces in white. Oh, I know they're not in his box, but Jimmy totally needs these and he wants them, I should say, but this is what we were looking for. These are two lavender scented hand sanitizers. He likes this size to travel at work and he refills them, which is great. So he could use these, thank you so much. Not that I couldn't use them. Sorry. Thank you. Ooh, fancy. These are the fancy things from the Dollar Tree that I never found. This is aromatherapy, lapril, or aromatherapy, April. There's like a line there and I thought it was an L. Aromatherapy, April, bath. It says bath and shower. And it is in the scent relax refreshing mint eucalyptus body wash and foaming wash and this is body lotion this is 14 ounces of body wash and 10 ounces of lotion it's amazing i believe that i have the ones from bath and body works and i bet you these yeah they smell the exact same wow i actually heard good things about them um oh my gosh i can't wait to try that that's amazing, thank you. It's like a spa day. I'll give myself a facial, put on my new socks, take a shower. Not in that order. I'm not gonna put on my socks and then take a shower. Oh, this is really cute. So I had this in a Dollar Tree haul and I went to show you how easy it was to rip the cactus off and then I destroyed it. So thank you for sending this to me, Robin. You have no idea how much that means. I keep staring at it on my desk going, what am I gonna do with this thing? More sanitizer, this is the Germex brand. Oh my God, you're so sweet. There's more. Oh, I never saw these. What, happy home. I never saw these. These are like plastic shadow boxes and they have like an elevated space and on like a clear acrylic, it says happy home. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. I never saw these. They has, it has four screws that elevate it and it's got like a, a cardboard on the back. Robin, thank you. Forget friend mail, it's like a Dollar Tree haul. Oh my gosh, there's more. This one says she believed she could, so she did. Uh -huh. Oh, I don't think she meant to send them broken. I think they broke in the box. It's okay, Robin though. This one says be useful, be kind, bring wine. And this is what the she believed she could, so she did, looks like. Thank you. And the final things are books, and that is why it's so heavy, because there are books in here. <gasps> what? What? Classic cookies with a modern twist. That looks beautiful. That's a coffee table book, if ever. Plus, it's recipes. Oh, my Atlanta. Ooh, chilling the dough. Coconut lime washboards. It's pickled and packed. Oh, my gosh, that's amazing. What if it has, like, Harvard Beets in here? Jimmy really wants me to make Harvard Beets like my dad used to make. He never told me how to make that one. Salad Niçois, okay. Yellow and green zucchini, roasted bell peppers, pickled onions. What? That is very cool. Oh, that is very cool. Look how pretty it is too. And then the last one. Oh, I know, that's Katie Lee. Katie Lee's on the Food Network. She's on, uh, what do I watch her on? The, the Chew, no, what's it called? It's called The Kitchen. Um, 
This is Endless Summer Cookbook. Oh my, the first page I turned to was gazpacho. They have green gazpacho. I guess it's made with tomatillas. See this cucumbers. Oh, green zebra tomatoes. It's not tomatillas. Wow. Cucumbers, onion, parsley, avocado, jalapenos, garlic. That sounds amazing. Oh my. Ooh, hoisin ginger pork chops. <gasps> Robin. <sighs> so, first let me say thank you. This was an amazing start to finish birthday gift. Robin. And again, thank you so much. Every piece I in both boxes, ladies, I feel like was just handpicked for me. So thank you so much. I think I need Jimmy. I've said this before, so I don't mean to repeat myself. I feel so much love from my YouTube family. I am abundantly blessed. Beyond really what words can say. When when so many things want to keep you discouraged and keep you down it is such an amazing feeling when someone can lift you up and bring some light into your day into your light into your night whatever it is into your heart I already knew that I was gonna have an amazing birthday just with my family being here and my friends. But you guys just knocked it over the ball. Yeah. But you girls just knocked it out of the park. Robin, thank you for every single solitary piece in here. I can't wait to show Jim what he got. Um, he is working late tonight, so I'm hoping that I can upload it with this video because I want you guys to get this out, uh, get this out to you right away. So, um, if not, I'll definitely add it to the next friend mail video if it comes. Um, but I cannot thank you enough. This was amazing. This was just a beautiful surprise. just I feel so loved so loved um, thank you for everything and of course Anne as always you are an amazing artist you're a thoughtful friend I appreciate you so much um, thank you again for everything and you guys if you have any questions please leave them in the comments down below for the ladies um, if you're interested in sending me friend mail and watching me open it on YouTube there is a, like, I ask everybody to just email me. There's a, my email address is in the description box down below. It's mrsgarthb2 at gmail.com. Um, I just ask that because I 
as you can see, like by saying that Mary, Infant Mary was giving me the bag, I have a hard time keeping track of everything. <laughs> so this is how I keep track of it. Um, so thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Um, yeah. I love you. And as always, you guys take care. God bless. I'll see you next time. Bye. That made me smile. <laughs>